Today, I have the pleasure of speaking with Greg Andrews from Search Minerals. How are you today, Greg? I'm fantastic, Tracy. Thank you. Greg, you were one of our top performers last night. Your stock was up 253% in 2021. So how about we just start there with what has happened since 2022 began? Well, it's been a, a, a very busy start to the year. We, we've come off a of successful financing. We've, we have $7 million in our till. We're executing on four sort of projects that are ongoing that we continue our sprint to production. We're working hard on our expiration where we've just put out a job postings for 13 people to increase our workforce so that we can get the 14,000 meters of drilling done at Deep Fox. Uh, we'll be doing some more work at our Fox Meadow. That's one of our steps. We just announced today, Dave Dreisinger, Dr. Dave Dreisinger is at SGS Canada, and we're starting to run through our 80 tons of material that we took from Deep Fox and Foxtrot to process with our new technology of grinding and the magnetic work. So we're excited about that. Um, our third is we've been working on our PEA that encompasses everything from our drill program of last year to our new finds with Dave's technology with the, the beneficiation in front of our direct extraction process. And uh, so that PA will really reset our value, which we believe because of all the matrix of increased production, increased recoveries, all the things that we've improved since 2016 um, uh, is taking place. And then that takes us into our environmental and uh, uh, environmental uh, applications to get the project back in front of the government to uh, get the, firm, the permitting because Deep Fox hasn't been a project that is, has been uh, in front of the environmental board there. So a lot of moving parts and all different individuals. We just hired a, a, a chief offer, operating officer to help me get all this project done as we're just expanding and uh, getting, our project, getting our project going. So for those of you out there that have noticed, there is a lot of interest in rare earths again, a lot of interest. Can you tell me what are the most compelling reasons why someone should be looking at search minerals? I, obviously, I think they should start with management and your history, but what are you telling the investors presently? I think what we tell the investors is, you know, we've had a business plan that we've been executing um, for a long time. And it was really just in 2021, Tracy, with the investor um, interest into the EV expansion is really what's starting to drive investment dollars into our industry and people looking at companies and where they are. And we look at our company as one of the most advanced in North America with number one, our resources, not only just that resource, we're a district. So we also have other properties that we can develop. Uh, number two, our technology we've been working on since 2010 with a bench scale and two pilot plants. We produce product and we're just optimizing that uh, optimization, even looking at the beneficiation. So we, we continue to lower our look to lower our capital costs, our operating costs to make this project viable. They it certainly helps with the recent price increases of all the the NDPR, the permanent magnet material that we are that we are after have all uh increased almost three times since 2020. So uh, all these things are really happening to put eyes on the rare earth industry and then throw in that really this industrial revolution of what's the EV market is going to, what infrastructure is going to be needed. And these OEMs having ambitious goals to electrify their fleets, they, they are starting to look down that supply chain to say, can we really do this? Who are our magnet makers? Who are our alloy makers? Where's the raw materials coming from? Because there aren't many operating deposits outside of China uh, that, that they'll need to secure if they're going to be looking at building plants in North America, Europe, Japan, wherever, wherever it's all taking place. So I think that's where really the um, OEM starting to look, but that's, that's what's got the investor interest too. So Greg, what should investors or shareholders presently be looking forward to in this next quarter or two? Well, I think what the investors are looking forward to is our updated PEA. That, that puts the economics on our project because the, the market only has our PEA from 2016, which was only on the Foxtrot deposit. So what, what the 2022 PEA will talk about the economics are, are about five variables that are key. Number one, we're adding Deep Fox as a resource. So that, that will increase production from 1,000 tons per day to 2,000 tons per day. It will extend the mine life to be an open pit mine over you know, 15 to 20 years. 
Um, since 2016, we've increased our recoveries from our technology from Dr. Dreisinger. So that's gone from 79% to, to nine, over 90%. Uh, the Deep Fox resource in itself is a better resource from Fox Todd in that it has 15% higher grades. Um, the, the current work that we're doing with the grinding and magnetic work and updating our flow sheet, once again, to continue to lower those operating costs, will uh, increase, again, the NPV and make that project um, you know, look more robust. And number four or five it is the price increases you know, have, have surpassed what our prices were in 2016. And, um, and they're looking very favorable so that we're hoping that we'll be able to say our PEA of today is actually economic at today's prices, as opposed to what we said in 2016 is we, we're not economic, we need our prices to double. So that's a very significant point that if we, our PEA, we say we're economic at today's prices, that gives the investor that macro decision that, wow, if, if we believe the rare earth prices are gonna stabilize or go up, or at least be circulated here is they're not bank. You can take the pricing out of your your macro investment of search minerals to say here's the business plan and and price they're 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 okay at this price. Well, Greg, we've been following you a long time, and we are delighted by these updates and look forward to speaking to you soon. Again, that's Greg Andrews from Search Minerals. Thank you, Greg. Thank you, Tracy.